I'm Terry. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm very excited today because I have my Jeffree Star mystery boxes. In this one, we're going to do the big daddy. I can't remember which one it's called. I think it's called Deluxe because it, the way that I would think that it'd be ordered is different, like platinum and premium and deluxe and everything are different levels that don't make sense to me. <laughs> so the big one is what I have today. You will see me in the same get up, the same clothing. I will post the other two in another video. I didn't want to post them all at the same time because the video would be like super long. So it just made sense to divide them up that way. And I know everyone wants to see the big one first. So that's what we're going to do. So before we get into it, you know the drill. Press the little red button to subscribe and like and share and all the fun little things. Um, leave a comment below. We'll talk about that in a minute. And let's get started. So I'm going to do my preface. Um, now, I'm not going to wait till the end to say my little spiel because I know not everyone goes to the end. So before you watch this video, I've got a little thing to say. I know that not everybody likes Jeffree Star. I know there's still some cancel culture going on. Um, if you don't like him, you don't want to have anything to do with him, then please keep on scrolling. If you are going to leave nasty comments below, keep on scrolling. Or maybe go ahead and leave those comments because it creates more traffic my way. So as far as that goes, do whatever you want. Um, but listen, I am a broke single mom and Jeffree Star products are um, my splurge. I do the mystery boxes. That's how I um, collect my more fancy makeup. It works well on my skin. Um, it's just, it's what I like. Um, I don't know the truth about the whole situation. It's all drama. Who's doing what for shares? Who's saying what? I don't care. I don't pay attention to it. I just know that there's a lot of hate and I 100% don't care. I don't subscribe to cancel culture. And so if you do, then please move along and catch up with me on another video. So, no more rambling. Let's open up this thing. <laughs> I never remember how to open these things. They're, they open a little differently than most boxes. I think this part just lifts off. Yes. Okay, deep breath. Who's excited? Ah, it's all covered up. I can't see anything. <laughs> okay, so I took that off. I'm going to just grab first thing. We have it is a lip scrub in strawberry gum. I do love the lip scrubs. My lips are, I don't know, they've always been this way. I, I won't blame it on age, but they're textured um, and they're, they're not like firm. I also chew on them a lot. <laughs> so these lip scrubs actually are um, a lifesaver. They feel really good even if you're not wearing lipstick. And we'll talk about that in a minute too, after we get through here. But the next thing I'm pulling out, I hope it's a gloss. That's my favorite thing. It is a gloss. These glosses are my favorite thing ever. Control Freak, I do not have this one. Oh, I'm so excited. I have a whole collection of these glosses and they're all from like mystery boxes. Um, I don't, I can't afford to just like get things when I want them. So I get them through the mystery boxes so that I can afford to have a nice collection. I'm having a hard time getting this out. Woo. Ooh, it is a baby pink. It is really pretty. I don't know if you'll see much of anything. It just kind of goes to like a clear pink. You're not really gonna, but the smell. The smell. And the shine on these things are just, mm. and to like pull this out of your purse, it's a little wand, it's just cute. Okay, what next? This is in the shade Widow. It's a bullet lip balm. Is this like a special thing? I've never heard that he had a lip balm. Oh my goodness. Okay, I didn't even show you the packaging. 
<laughs> I got too excited. It's a bullet. I love these little bullets. They're so cute. I bet it's black. It is black. All right. So I have lipstick on, so I'm not going to like put this on over, but let's do a little. Okay. Yeah. It's not black. Like as it goes on, if anything, it's just like a, it's a slight hint of gray which makes my little goth heart happy <laughs> anyway. So I'm very excited about this. This, um, right up my alley. Oh, next. I love these too much. Don't know. I'm a guess velour in dominatrix. It's a velour liquid lip. I do like his crazy colors. Um, Dominatrix is one that I have wanted to try. It's very brown. Um, but because of the way that my lips are, these are very drying and they pucker a lot. So if you just pair a gloss over it, it's not you know as long lasting and it's it's gonna kiss off at that point but that way you can use these um, and it not create that like over drying effect and these two together actually would create a nice color for me again if you want to talk about um, lipstick like the velour liquid lipstick that's what I have on I'll talk about it at the end <laughs> what is I don't even know what to say. Um, this is an extreme frost in sour ice. If you know anything about Jeffree Star, these are very expensive and very sold out all the time. Um, they're also way more expensive than I could ever dream on spending for a highlighter. This is, <laughs> oh my gosh, this is absolutely too fancy for me. I don't, I don't know what to say. I'm trying hard to be a professional right now. Um, this is, this is a lot. This is not what I expected at all. So whew, these extreme frosts look very icy. I'm going to touch it. I don't want to touch it, but I'm going to touch it. Okay. So they look, they just look white. All of them just look white, but the magic comes in when you swipe them, <laughs> you get to see the color. And this one being sour ice is going to be a green color. Oh my gosh, that is going on my eyelids. That is the most spectacular thing I've ever seen in my life. Look at that. It's not like super chunky. I could play with that all day. That is amazing. Um, I'm very thankful right now because this is one of those things that I just didn't even think about buying because it's, you know, it's a highlighter and I can't spend money on just like a highlighter. So that, um, that's very much appreciated. Where do we go from here? I just, I don't know. Um, I feel something soft. All right, so this has to be the clothing item that they did ask for your size on this one. And I'm going to get glitter everywhere and it's gonna be fantastic and we're gonna love it. So it's black, which I like, and it has like a reverse tie dye, like a bleach. I kind of wish we would have gotten this before Halloween. It has the spider web logo on it and it has it on the back as well. It's really cute. It's going to have to be worn around the house. Um, I've heard a lot of people getting hate for wearing these things out. Um, I don't mind, but the fact that it's past Halloween, <laughs> so, um, 
I will wear it at home. I've already gotten glitter all over it and it's, it's fantastic. I love having glitter. <laughs> That's just kind of how I am. All right. There's still more things in there. There is a red rum. This is going to be a liner. I do need a red liner. This is, I did 100% need a red liner, so I am very happy. I am going to rip the packaging to get it out. <laughs> so, um, again, the packaging is just spectacular. Red rum is like a perfect red. Um, these are also eye safe if for some reason you want to use them around your eyes if you want red eyeliner on your eye I'm not sure why you would need that, but um, you can use them on other places on your face if you need to um, So yeah, I needed that All right, I think we have the last thing in here I just saw what it was. <laughs> I don't. Whew, this is hard. Maybe this is why I shouldn't have filmed this because I'm going to get emotional. This is one of those. <laughs> this is one of those items that, you know, poor single moms um, just don't like splurge on. Um, so it's something I never even really put on my list to um, to purchase. Um, and I know this is something that probably so many people have, but I don't. Um, and I've watched everyone else have it and I've just appreciated it from afar. There is a mirror at the top. Um, I do have some of the other ones that have come in the mystery boxes. I got Blue Blood, um, and Alien. Um, and yeah, I'm trying very hard not to, not to get emotional. Um, I know when these mystery boxes come around, um, I, so I save up and I even have to sell a few things to purchase all of them because I, this is how I build up my, um, collection because, you know, if I'm going to buy, you know, like an extreme froth, that's $50 in of itself. And this mystery box was a hundred dollars. So, um, the value is worth a little extra scrimping. Um, so yeah, I'm sorry that I'm, <laughs> the energy kind of went down because I'm just trying very hard not to be emotional because, um, it's not some, these are, especially the extreme frost and the blood sugar just aren't things that I would expect to own. So a big thank you to you for watching, but a big thank you also for Jeffree Star for, making these boxes um, a good value so that people like me can purchase the high quality items that I wouldn't otherwise. So before we leave, I want to talk to you about my lipstick. <laughs> I did purchase a Velour lipstick. Um, I've never bought one of his lipsticks or glosses or anything separately. Everything I've gotten has always come in these boxes, but um, this formula was something that spoke to me. Um, I told you earlier about the lip situation. Um, and so lipsticks, as far as color and my eyes and the way that they feel and everything else, um, this just, it seemed like something that I would enjoy. Um, I got it in the color Celebrity Skin, which looks something like this. 
it kind of matches my nails a little bit. Um, I wanted to try it because I have tried other nudes in the past. Everyone says, this is the perfect nude, but then when I put it on, then it becomes very pink. Um, apparently my lips turn everything very pink. Like you saw how brown that was, and you can see how pink it turned on me, which actually turned out to be the absolute perfect nude on me. So, um, as far as it feels, it is very, very feathery, very lightweight. It looks like your skin. I know that sounds really weird, but like you can't tell that it's like, you know, a, a coat on your lips. It just, I don't know. It's very hard to explain. It's a fantastic formula and I'm going to probably save up a little more to get a few more colors um, but because this formula is just absolutely amazing. If you um, aren't into cancel culture, I highly recommend the Velour lipstick, especially if you're a little older or your lips aren't all that full. Um, this is incredible. It feels fantastic and I absolutely love it. So with that, I'm going to go um, dry the tears up and, <laughs> and um, I will film the two smaller boxes and um, hopefully those will be out tomorrow. And thank you for watching. Please consider subscribing. I love you all. Bye.